In this video I am showing really easy way to fix non-working auto-return mechanism which is quite common problem in old automatic turntables made by Dual. This Dual turntable is attached to a combined device with receiver, amplifier and cassette deck all in one. Uh, this is awesome Finnish made flagship device called Salora 6600S. But anyway, back to turntable. There is lots of videos and online forums where people are talking about replacing the Stewer pimple, which is German name for a small rubber part. And idea is that rubber part is facing one of the plastic levers under the turntable and when the tone arm is moving, rubber part uh, is holding the lever in correct height and creates small amount of friction so that th everything is moving nicely. And when this rubber part is worn out or crumpled away over the years, this plastic lever is not moving as it should and auto return is not working even though the auto start is working fine. You can buy a spare part or you can make it by yourself with a piece of rubber from the pencil. And I made this part right here. It's a 5mm thick and it has 3mm hole at the center. Then the part is just pushed against the metal pin and it just stays there. And depending the model you may have to test different thicknesses but at least for this 496 model dual third table, that 5mm was quite fine. And then of course you should clean and lubricate all the moving parts to make sure the turntable is working as good as possible. And side note here, these two areas need to be clean and dry, so no lubrication here. But everything else, all the levers, joints, uh, sliding surfaces should be lubricated. Now everything back together and you're all set.